What's up, X Squad? Welcome back to our channel. We are here at the Orgullo Fest. Yes, Game yes. Five. First time ever in Boyle Heights, Los Angeles, California. That part. It is history being done today, guys. History is the first gay pride in Boyle Heights, East Los Angeles. I grew up in this area and we're so excited to show you guys around what is new, what's happening here at the Pride Fest, Orgullo Fest for you guys. So are you guys excited to show them around? Yes, we are. All right, guys, let's go x -Men. Let's show you guys around and let's see what's new here at Boyle Heights. And Pride. a big shout out to Noah Noah for making this possible. Thank you, guys. We love you, Noah Noah, like always. Let's get started. What's up, x -Mates? So we are starting our Guyo Fest. We're exploring the festival and we're going down for a street. If you guys notice, on the right side, you see all nothing but Mexican food trucks from your local LA and Boyle Heights area. On the left side, you see nothing but vendors, sponsors, and healthcare providers. So we're gonna keep walking down the street and hit the other stage, which is the red stage. On that stage, you're gonna find nothing but drag performances and a lot of announcements that are gonna be happening throughout the day. So, like I mentioned, look at all these delicious food trucks from the local, local Boyle Heights and LA area. vendor a small business here at the Orgullo Fest 2021 and you know us we love supporting small businesses Pico Cita is a small business that of course they create their own flavor chamoy with tahini and all that Mexican goodie flavor and they mix it in with the gummies they mix it with the gummy bears the gummy worms anything you can think of it is freaking delicious you guys can use our promo code x 9 x 26 to receive 20% off. And you guys, of course, go follow her at Pico Osita. Because let me tell you guys, this candy is amazing. The way she makes her, of course, her brand. Oh, bomb. You guys need to try it. Here's more information. Go follow her on the Snap. Go follow her on Instagram or on TikTok. Pico Osita and use our code, guys. So we're making our way back up to the main entrance and the main stage of the Orgullo Fest. But on the right side, you have local businesses that have been here in Boyle Heights for quite a while. And on the left side, you have resources, you have small vendors, and of course, you have healthcare providers that can help the LGBT community for whatever they need. And we want to give a huge shout out to the Red Bar. Red Bar has been open since the 1950s, um, giving the LGBT community in Boyle Heights a space to go and celebrate their pride. Then a huge thank you for always, always opening their doors for the LGBT community.
And now, Xmates, we are entering Noah Noah Plays. If you guys are familiar with our TikTok lives, our Instagram stories, we're here every Friday supporting this amazing business. And now, let me show you guys around Noah Noah Plays if you guys are wondering what it's all about. So, we're walking inside, and if you guys can tell, here at Fest, it is full. It's a full house. So, on the left, look at the decorations. Look how they decorated this place. And a huge shout out to Daisy coming up the stairs right here on the lab. We love you so much, Daisy. And look at the banderitas that they put. I mean, they're always here every Friday, but just the culture itself of this restaurant, this bar, speaks for itself. And why not celebrate Orgullo Fest with some shots? So thank you so much, Daisy, for these shots. Y salud, guys. Y la seduré con mis pasos 
esos mágicos cry, right? Because Woo! I think our community needed this so bad. Yeah! But it's so beautiful to see you coming through, right? I swear, I went to bed last night and I prayed that people will come to the first one of Woo! many. And you did. So thank you. Come on, Jesse! Come on, Jesse! <laughs> I usually am not a speaker, I'm not here. There's Woo! bigger talking, so gracias. Um, but do want to say thank you so much for being out here. The fact that we have all you guys here in the front of the stage and our beautiful, beautiful Woo! fucking drag queen, yo. Like, they've been with us since the pandemic. That means December. Thank you, Melissa. I appreciate we reached out to her in the very beginning. So, gracias. Boyle Heights needs Woo! this. We will continue doing this. Come on, Come on. Come on. Muchas gracias. Mi nombre es Luis Octavio, and I'm one of the co-owners, como había dicho Melissa. And the reason why we started this is because we are more than queer Latinx on Thursdays, on Sundays, and we are not a fucking theme night. 
We are cleaning our necks 24 7. And there is no reason why we need to leave our neighborhoods to enjoy something like this. And also, we are tired of having a Latino quote unquote stage or a small stage at Pride events. Y por eso hicimos Orgullo Fest. With our Latinidad in mente. And that is why we did this, so that we can enjoy it with children, with our parents, with grandparents, y con la comunidad. So take a look behind you. Everybody turn around. Look behind you. Look behind you. Because el próximo año esto va a estar a reventar. Muchísimas gracias. Thank you so much. And follow us at Noa Noa Place to the drag queens. To Melissa, to the House of Be Fierce, we could not have done this without you. Thank you so much for believing in us, and thank you so much for believing in this small dream that we had, which is creating a small bar donde la gente podría venir, un lugar de ambiente donde todo es diferente. Muchas, muchas, muchas gracias. Thank you. Vámonos con un poquito de música. Para seguir el baile, hey, 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 DJ. And there you guys have it, x -Base, our vlog here at the Orgullo Fest 2021 Gay Pride Boyle Heights, East Los Angeles has come to an end. But before we go, guys, we want to give a huge shout out to Noah Noah for making this um, festival happen. Thank you, guys. Yay. And as well, let's do a recap of today's festival, guys, all right? So, Mike, what was your favorite part of today's festival? Honestly, I didn't have a favorite part because the whole festival was great. The vendors, the food, the performers, everybody who contributed in the whole event did a, an amazing job. Yeah. Yeah. And Ray, what was your favorite part to this event? My favorite part would have to be the day drinking. I really, myself, really don't like it, but today, I guess yeah. everybody's, you know, been on the same level, vibing to the same music. It was actually pretty cool. And we were out there celebrating for the same thing, so the vibe was yeah. just amazing. And my favorite part of today's festival was that we were part of history, guys. History was just made in Boyle Heights for having the first gay pride ever and as well we're just excited to come back next next year and hopefully this festival continues to grow grow and grow till next time ex mates